Hello and welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Two Cam Plays. And guys, today some exciting news has dropped regarding the Hot Wheels Monster Truck Universe. A new game titled Stunt Mayhem has been announced and uh, it looks interesting. So we're gonna take a deep dive into the trailer and probably more exciting Monster Truck news. The long awaited Monster Jam Overdriven update has finally been released. New trucks, new maps, New cutscene and new UI proves that this is the undisputed king of all Monster Jam games on Roblox. Also last week, another exciting trailer dropped for Wreckfest 2. If you guys know me, you know that I am a Wreckfest fan. I'm super excited for Wreckfest 2. We're gonna do a deep dive into that trailer as well. With that, let's get started. Okay, so this trailer is actually really short. It's only 40 seconds long and it has a lot of quick cuts. So we don't get to see a whole lot of gameplay. We do get to see a lot of the trucks that are gonna be featured in the game, including Race Ace, Five Alarm, Gunkster, Tiger Shark, Bigfoot, of course, and the new Skelosaurus. If you guys know me, you've been around for a while, you know that I don't really collect the Hot Wheels monster truck trucks all that often, but uh, occasionally I do see some that I really like and I'll pick them up. The one that I'm most excited though for is a Bone Shaker, which Bone Shaker is featured prominently on this loop the loop. The gameplay though, I, I can't really tell exactly what the gameplay is. It looks kind of like a cross between uh, Hot Wheels Unleashed and Monster Jam Crush It. Now, the developers of this game is Game Mill Entertainment. They actually are the developers of Monster Jam Crush It. So if you've played that game, I think you'll probably have an idea of what this game is going to be all about. Uh, it looks very similar, although it does look like there is kind of a freestyle, uh, sort of. We only get a couple of seconds of the trucks doing uh, some tricks in an arena type event, so uh, it's kind of hard to tell exactly what this game is going to be all about. There is some head-to-head -head, uh, split-screen action, um, but uh, that's pretty much all we get to see. Now, this was announced uh, yesterday on August 13th, and it's going to release October 18th. So that's like two months from announcement to release, which tells me a couple things. One, that it's probably not gonna be a very big game, and two, that it's, uh, it's probably gonna be kind of inexpensive. Uh, so I don't think that they're planning on uh, having a whole lot of marketing for this game. I think it's going to be kind of low key. And I think that because the release date is so close to Showdown, I think they're kind of hoping to grab onto some of the audience that's uh, falling away from Showdown by the time this comes out. I'm not sure how excited I am for this game, but I am going to play it. I'm going to pick it up. The trailer did not mention anything about price. It's not available on Amazon just yet as of recording or on GameStop for pre-order. There was one website that I don't really trust all that well that listed it at $39.99. Uh, I expect that this game will probably drop in price really quickly, so um, I wouldn't buy it for $39.99 if I were me. One thing that I was discussing with some guys on the Discord about, I find it interesting that Hot Wheels has gone with a developer other than Milestone because of how successful that Hot Wheels Unleashed was. Perhaps Milestone has just been busy with Showdown and didn't have time to work on Stunt Mayhem. Maybe there was some sort of contractual obligation that Milestone had with um, Feld that they were not able to do anything for Hot Wheels during this time period. Maybe, uh, maybe Hot Wheels just wanted to release a cheap game uh, quickly. Uh, who knows? Um, but either way, Milestone is not developing this game. It is Game Mill Entertainment. Game Mill Entertainment actually has quite a lot of um, games under their belt, mostly the Nickelodeon games, Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, which uh, from what I've heard is kind of fun. I haven't played it. It's like a Mario Smash Bros um, copycat game with um, Nickelodeon characters instead. There really isn't anything else other than Monster Jam Crush It that uh, that I really recognize. But anyway, look for more stunt mayhem in the future as the game gets closer to launch. All right, guys, let's check out Monster Trucks Overdriven, the total overhaul. I know a lot of people are super excited about this. I'm probably not going to play for too long, but uh, I do want to give this a quick shout out and a quick check it out. Earth Mover, there's Earth Mover right there. So I love this new intro screen and I love the new music. It's not super blurring loud in my ears like it was before. I love this little cutscene, and there's the new title screen. It's a little cut off there at the top. That might be just my screen. All right, let's check out the tracks. Now, I didn't play a whole lot of Overdriven, but I know that there is a lot more tracks than there was before. 
let's take a look and see what we got here. We got World Showdown Retro, uh, World Showdown, Flame v. Frost. Oh, Fire versus Ice. That's awesome. Uh, okay, let's do a Fire versus Ice track. Let's do it. I don't know if there was a Flame v. Frost that that was before or that was new. That looks pretty cool, though. We're going to give it a shot and let's take a look and see what new trucks we've got. Uh, and like I said, I know that there's a new UI here, too. There's my character. Guys, I know a lot of you have been asking to play Roblox with me, play Monster Jam Overdriven specifically. I just haven't had a whole lot of time between the showdown coverage that I've been doing and between my playthrough of Monster Jam Steel Titans 2 with Dr. Destructo. I just haven't had a whole lot of time. I want to do a full tournament night. That would be kind of fun. Okay, let's take a look at the spawner here. Ooh, I like the garage. Ooh, that's nice. Okay, so I think... SEC secret is what I'm thinking is our creeping death chain. These are all secrets that I found in previous playthroughs and SUV animalistic. I know an SUV was in there before Avenger. Oh, dude. Oh, sweet. See, now this is how you do Avenger. Look at all those. I know there was the lions. Oh, nice. That one must be new. A graffiti. That one's definitely new. Okay. Got to do the Avenger graffiti. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, it, Oh, dude, that is sick. Good job, guys. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Definitely good job. Okay, now I, I gotta remember I can move my my mouse, but I can't move my my stick. Oh wait, I want to turn off damage because uh, I suck. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at the, the fire versus ice here. Uh, actually, I think this may have been a track that was in here before. I don't remember, guys. I'm sorry. Whoa! <laughs> Yo! Okay, yeah, this is cool. I definitely need to do some more overdriven. Yo! <laughs> uh, Yo! <laughs> Almost did a double. <laughs> uh, all right. Yeah, okay, so anyway, from what I understand, there's new trucks, there's been, of course, the new UI, there is new uh, environmental effects, from what I understand, it can rain, it could be cloudy, like it is now, uh, there could be sunshine, um, all kinds of, of course, this is the cloudiest it ever gets in Vegas, <laughs> and of course, there's all kinds of new tracks, and there's new trucks, um, Avenger, of course, has been in there before, but uh, dang, holy cow. Milestone, if you're watching, this is how you do it. You got to get as many variants in as you possibly can. Ah, oh, dude. <laughs> it doesn't take much to make us happy, guys. It <laughs> really doesn't. It really doesn't. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, look for a new showdown. Overdriven, not showdown. Look for an overdriven tournament coming soon. I'll probably just host it because, like, I'm really really bad guys i'm really bad let's see if i can get another double here whoa corkscrew <laughs> oh man all right moving on moving on all right the other exciting news of course is that wreckfest 2 trailer that i talked about now uh the trailer itself has some language so i, I will put a link in the description but be forewarned there is um it's been probably pg-13 anyway so the trailer shows off some of the cool physics of course wreckfest is known for its soft body physics meaning you know the crushable cars and the uh, damage physics which uh, you can see in this trailer that it's just super spectacular. One of the great things about Wreckfest is just the total chaos that comes from all of the demolition derby race physics that, that are you're doing. And Wreckfest 2 seems to capitalize on that feeling of just demolition derby and really ramp that up to 11. The whole trailer, other than cutting to these cutscenes that are cinematic, is taken from the perspective of the drivers, the dash cam, but like from behind. So you get to see all of the, the chaos and the mayhem ensuing from behind the driver of the truck or the car and uh yeah it just looks spectacular i cannot wait to play this game now what's super exciting about wreckfest 2 is that it will have integrated steam workshop support meaning there will be a heavy mod community for this game. Whether or not they're going to bring monster trucks into this game is yet to be seen. 
I really hope so. Looking at Hank and a Brute and all of you guys at Bean Monsters, I'm not sure if you can import your models into Wreckfest 2. That would be super, super cool if you can. I guess we'll just have to wait until the game releases to find out more on that. Now, no official launch date on Wreckfest 2 just yet, but you darn well better believe that I will be playing more Wreckfest leading up to the launch of Wreckfest 2, and I will be having a lot more coverage of Wreckfest 2 as more details are announced. I cannot wait. All right, guys, I think that is all the non-showdown monster truck news that I have got for you today. Sure to appreciate you watching. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Check out the video that you see on your screen right now. And hey, we'll see you guys on the flip side. Later, everybody. Bye. <laughs>